Hi, my name is Cora Lewis. A pure culture is made up in a lab containing a single species of organism. A pure culture originally comes from a mixed culture. There are three types of pure culture techniques to get the pure culture outcome from a mixed culture. There's a spread plate, a pour plate, and a streak plate. As you begin a streak plate process, you want to make sure that everything is sterilized. Otherwise, you won't get the desired results and the outcome that you need. For this procedure, you need a few materials. You need a port, um, you need an agar, agar plates, a Bunsen burner, you need an inoculation loop, and a mixed culture. And in a mixed culture is bacteria. Millions and millions of bacteria can be in a mixed culture. So the first thing you want to do to start this process is you want to take your inoculation loop and you want to sterilize it over a Bunsen burner. From that, you take the inoculation loop that, that now contains your mixed culture and you want to spread it across an agar plate in different streaking motions and you never really want to go over the same place twice otherwise you won't get the isolated colonies that you are aiming for. You continue this process over however many agar plates you need and you continue to sterilize it after each dip and streak that way it doesn't get contaminated and everything is pure. Um, after the agar plates you want to, or after the streaking procedure, you want to stick the agar plates into an incubation for a certain amount of time. From this, your desired outcome should be successfully isolating colonies to be able to identify what these organisms are that are on these plates. And this can help you with patients I give you a, a specimen like a blood sample or a urine sample or anything um, if they're sick the streak plate process will help identify what is what these organisms are in this patient and this can help um, being able to diagnose them being able to treat them and successfully help them get back to health thank you